The Queen of Memory Loss, Nicola Sturgeon, has once again forgotten a key moment during her latest financial scandal. Hello everybody, welcome to the channel that challenges the mainstream media and the political establishment from the left-wing nutters to the globalist elite. We've got a number of news stories for you guys which I'm going to react to and analyze. The first one is about Nicola Sturgeon. This isn't a, re this isn't a new financial scandal. Um, to be fair, there's a whole list of SMP's financial incompetence and corruption and missing money and everything else. This one is just weird because they're all linked together. We have already talked about Nicola Sturgeon and, and her husband, uh, Peter Morrell, uh, who is uh, the head of uh, the executive of uh, the SNP as a party. And um, one of the issues is about the money that was uh, loaned. That money was £107,000. Now, Nicola Sturgeon claims that she cannot recall when her husband loaned the SMP £107,000. Now, I'm not, we're not naive. But we, we know that a lot happens throughout your life, especially if you're First Minister of Scotland. You've got a lot of details to deal with. But if your husband is also a key figure in your party, and your party's, your party's going through some financial issues, if there's going to be any money being borrowed, I'm pretty sure that's one of those incidents that you would remember. But the queen of memory loss, Nicola Sturgeon, cannot recall. Okay, what are the details of this, by the way? Now, despite being the SNP's chief official for 20 years, Mr. Morrell failed to declare this money on time to the Electoral Commission. That's where the whole issue came from. Now, all loans to political parties of more than £7,500 must be declared within 30 days of the quarter in which they are made, meaning by the end of July 2021 in this case. Now, somehow that wasn't declared on time and somehow Nicola Sturgeon, as the leader of the party, once again, lost her memory. Again, this issue, you might just say there are all the other scandals that matter more, but again, if you all put the tiny scandals together, it creates a mountain of corruption, incompetence, complacency, and complicity, because they're all in it together, and not in a, not in a good way. But we're going to be keeping an eye on this issue, as usual, uh, until Nicola Sturgeon actually resigns or gets pushed out. We're going to have a lot more material and content related to her and her party. The best thing you can do is subscribe to the channel. I'm Maya Tusi, and we are the media.